Jeepneys in the Philippines are considered to be the king of the road. They are the backbone of public transportation in many major cities. Deeming popular among Filipinos for its convenience and low fare rates. They're famously known for their vibrant, loud colors. The sides of jeepneys can portray anything from religious icons, TV and movie characters, NBA teams and players, beautiful scenery, word art, or family members. The name jeepney is said to be a combination of the words jeep and jeepney. Jeep being the military styled vehicle similar to the ones we often see on the roads today, while jeepney is a term used for a vehicle that carries passengers for a low fare. Tour guide Henry Enahe explains that Jeep came from the American car and knee came from the experience of passengers riding the vehicle since their knees were hitting each other during the ride. The jeepney started appearing on the streets of Manila in the 1950s after World War II ruined the country's transportation infrastructure. After the war, Americans left a surplus of jeeps and military vehicles behind. Filipinos bought these cars in bulk and converted them into a means of transport that could drive multiple passengers. Similar to how Filipinos took American canned goods and revamped them into something that satisfies taste buds, Filipinos also Filipinized the Jeep. They took useless leftover scraps and turned them into something that could be used. Filipinos lengthened the American vehicle to accommodate more passengers and attached a roof to protect them from the scorching Philippine heat. The seats were removed and replaced with two benches that stretched lengthwise on either side, allowing more seating space and leaving a narrow space down the middle for an aisle. Every jeepney has a route that is indicated on the side of the jeep or displayed using a small card in the front windshield. Jeepneys will also stop anywhere along their route to pick up or drop off passengers. Despite the jeepney's popularity, the vehicle faces an uncertain future as it has been criticized for a number of issues. These vehicles are powered by old diesel engines and many of them even lack in the basic filtration systems to purify exhaust fumes from burning dirty diesel fuel. Their safety has also been called into question because of their lack of seatbelts and use of scavenged parts that may cause malfunctions.
Whenever you visit the Philippines, be sure to try riding a jeepney.